Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Today we're going to be making this gorgeous cell phone stand. We're going to be experimenting with gold foils in resin. So let's jump in and get started. I went ahead and mixed up my resin off camera. I'm using the liquid diamonds resin. It's a two to one ratio and you can get it from the epoxy resin store. I'll be sure to link it down below along with my coupon code. I have a 20% off coupon code for the epoxy resin store products. And it, also if you want to see a tutorial showing step by step how to mix your resin and your glitters, I'll link one of those down below in the description box. I just cut the mixing out of this video to save time. So I'm just filling up my mold with clear. I poured about two ounces or 1.5 to two ounces just in the bottom of my cell phone stand mold here. I got this mold off Etsy. I'll link it down below as well if you guys want to get one. I'm taking a little spatula um, tool and just making sure the resin is touching all the spaces or the blank spaces in the mold. And here are my gold foils. I got them from Joyce Artwork on Instagram. She's an amazingly talented artist and she started selling gold foils so I wanted to give them a try. To add my foils, what I did, as you can see, is just placed it on the wet resin and I'm going to add a little rose next to the moon here. And then what I'm going to do is take my finger and push it down so those air bubbles will come out. When you place your foil down, you're going to get some air bubbles under there, but don't worry, just push it and the air bubbles will go to the side. I sprayed the bubbles with some 91% isopropyl alcohol and that was it. Just covered it up, let it dry for 24 hours. And now we're going to fill up the mold the rest of the way. I'm going to be using some glitters from Dryer Days Art Studio. This one here is a sparkler glitter. It's called Fairy Forest. And I added two or three drops of passion purple alcohol ink just to give it a little bit more of a purple look and here i'm going in with Catherine's uh, holographic gold glitter this glitter you guys oh my gosh it's my new favorite it's such a beautiful gold glitter you'll see when we demold it and that was it. I honestly just did the lines in random patterns, um, just filling the mold up the rest of the way. And I'm going to spray it with some isopropyl alcohol, cover it up, let it dry, and then we'll be ready to demold it. And here we are. It's 24 hours later. We're going to get ready to pop this out of the mold. I was so excited to see how this one turned out. Look at those beautiful glitters. The fairy forest and the holographic gold go so well together. And I was excited to see how this part of the cell phone stand turned out. I wanted to see how those foils looked and it turned out perfectly. It's kind of hard to see the foils in this lighting, but I'll be sure to bring it in some better lighting to show you guys. Look at how pretty. I absolutely love this piece. It has a really, really great sparkle. I'm going to insert a clip here of the cell phone stand all assembled in natural lighting, and you can really see how gorgeous and sparkly those glitters are. And the foils were a lot of fun to work with. Um, if you do use them, you know, just make sure you get all the air bubbles out from underneath when you place the foil down on your wet resin. Um, and you'll be able to tell too because the foils are transparent. So you'll be able to see if there's any air bubbles trapped under there. Just keep pushing it down and eventually the air bubbles will flow off to the side of the foil. And then you can go in and spray it with some 91% isopropyl alcohol to pop those bubbles. But let me know what you guys think of this piece. I absolutely love it. I might have to keep this one for myself. I just love the sparkle of that holographic gold glitter. And if you guys want to get um, any of these glitters, I'll link them down below in the description box along with my coupon code. You can use discount code NAPTIME at Catherine's store. And here's how it looks with the cell phone in the stand. Here's a little spot where your charger can fit in there. And as always, I'll link all the materials I used in this mold down below in the description box, along with any coupon codes that I have. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, leave me a like, subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, and leave me a comment down below. I love hearing from you guys. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you soon for another video. Bye!